Hey, it's Tree. So today, I'm going to be touring a bunch of signs that I made in 2019. As you can tell, a zine is basically a piece of folded up paper with a slit in the middle. This is how you make them. Um, some people do staple together papers, but this is the classic design. I'm Like I said, I made these all in 2019. Um, I started getting into it because I had heard about them previously, but I, like I said, I started making them for a speech class that I had, and one of them was an informative speech, and I figured um, anyone could make a sign would be a good speech, so that's what I did for that speech class. Um, it was required by my major, and then a couple months later, I started to make more. Um, just during my art history classes mainly um, because there's a note heavy class and I knew about a lot of the topics and art she's talking about so I didn't really see <laughs> um, I needed something to do while I was listening basically because if I'm not doing something while I'm listening I tend to like tear up my fingers um, it's not a good habit. <laughs> so I would draw these in between taking notes. If I finish a slide, I'd be drawing on one of these. Or, um, that's why some of them at the end aren't as filled because we're getting closer to finals and I didn't have as much time to draw in these. And then after that, I kind of forgot about making any more for a couple of years. These kind of sat in my drawer. And that's where they've lived for the past few years. They've kind of been beat up a little bit because, uh, like I said, I was carrying these to college. So uh, the ones in pencil were smudgy and gross. So I recently decided to take a piece of paper and a pen and <laughs> just re-outline these and make a new one. Um, I'm not sure when I'll make more of these, but I figured that um, it'd be a good time to tour all of these from 2019, so that way when I make more it won't be too much of a hassle to film a ton of these, <laughs> mostly because it's very easy to just sit there and doodle in one of these. It's just a small piece of paper. It doesn't take that much to fill it. And if you ever want to make a sign like these, it's very easy to do. You don't even have to have um, that many artistic skills. You could literally just paste pieces of paper or photography or write little poems in them. It, it's just a very easy medium to get into. Hence why I made that speech, um, anyone can make a sign. <laughs> So, as we're getting to the end here, one of these is the newest one I've made. So, the next time I tour these, I might, might not include that one. But, that one I made recently because I was thinking about signs again. I, I don't know if I saw a YouTube video or I just saw these sitting in my drawer and that's what made me think of them. But, I, I definitely do want to make more. I, I don't know when I'll make more, but I will. Um... And I guess um, that one at the end is a title reveal for my next project. I've already claimed it on to pass, uh, so I'm very excited to work on it when it does come out. It's just taking me some time to write it. I will provide some more details in future videos for sure. But it is called I Just Want to Paint. It is about my vampire OC Harper and my other OC that I designed for fall, which was like a pumpkin spice elf, is now Blair the Human. <laughs> because you can't have vampires without humans. <laughs> and what led me to thinking about this project name um, and concept was basically being like, what would I do if I was a vampire? Well, I just want to paint. I want to make art. <laughs> so Harper is me in that way. <laughs> It's definitely going to be um, LGBTQ focused, so it's going to be a fun time. But I suppose we're getting down the line, so 
if you like listening to me ramble, subscribe for more content. I will be getting more into this project um, as the weeks go by. So if you want to hear more about it, it will be coming soon. And I will see you next time. Um, I'm not sure when. I'm just making content when I want to. So that's why you should subscribe and maybe hit the bell if you want to see more content from me. And yeah, yeah, I, I will see you next time. I will quit rambling. Goodbye.